Hey guys, Dasker here. This is the Level BF 5e5 Finals Cup between Exertus and Mortality on this map, Dawnbreaker. Exertus won their first map. It's best of three maps. You're gonna like this. Where is Widgety though? Widgety should have ops here, but wait guys, enough about Widgety though. We will be doing instead some live matches. This is live. They're all moving. We have uh, Mortality on US. We have Exertus on Chinese. I like this. Shane is a ghost push. He is pushing out of Charlie. I like this bottom flank. He sees one. There's a lot of damage. Nope, but he gets taken out. We see. We see Mortality already taken two for real fast. Looking at these setups, though, going to Troya, they're trying to get Bravo, but oh, there is so much fighting, and we see Mortality spread out. Troya knows his two guys are down, going for revive. Nope, no revives. They are being bled out. Wreck with a three for already. Going to Wreck. He is low, 40% health. Wreck does take out one, holding down Bravo. This is the mortality that we saw throughout the rest of this event, holding it down, getting kills. They haven't died once, guys. Except now. Now they're now what now a few of them died. A good run this far. Wreck going ham. Five and oh. Johnny. Doing some damage. Guys that are watching, this stream is 60 seconds behind, approximately. Somehow, though, Exertus was able to get uh, both Alpha and Charlie and while contesting Bravo at the same time. The advantage has been flipped around, surprisingly. Alpha, though, is being taken, going to Steve. Stila is there taking back Alpha. Using the barrier instead of going through the metal tetris does not want to be heard. Stila taking the damage. Watch out. Exertus is now holding this. It's 183 to 153 in favor of mortality, but the bleed is in the favor of Exertus. Going to the tabletop. I do like what Rex do it here. He's going for Charlie, but does he know there's like, two guys behind him? He does see one, maybe. He gets blowed up instead. He did get back rage, although John Mino also in the back. Taking a lot of damage. Charlie is being taken back by Exertus. All the while we see by pushing up onto Bravo. See chain as the character gets taken out. Psycho gets taken as well. Johnny's the only one up. Their 30 ticket advantage has quickly been reduced. In respawns, but no, no, no. They gotta get out of here. They're barely holding on to Alpha, going to... Going to, to wreck, being a bit aggressive on Bravo. Throwing nades, but where are the guys? Where are they? Oh no. Wreck does get taken out. So does Psycho. Their perimeter is being eroded. Going to Shane as it goes on Exertus side. Takes out one, but he gets taken out. Going instead to Troya. Troya reviving. Somehow, Shane as a ghost survived that. 143 to 152. Four minutes in. And take an advantage now for Exertus. Oh, Troy had just easy kills. Easy tapping it out. And 
Oh, Troy again. Another almost gets a two. A quick 180 real close, but clicks, cleans it up, and gets a revive. Yes, he does. Exertus does have the advantage right now and is going for a triple. Alpha, though, is being contested, so that may be short-lived. Oh, yeah. We see three mortality players on Alpha. Psycho just going right through the metal detectors. Doesn't even care. Let's go to Wreck real quick. Wreck ends up killing one, already on Bravo, taking it back. 124 to 143 in favor of Exertus. And now it's the hold for Exertus. Well, no, maybe. Exertus is taking Alpha, waiting for a counter push by Mortality. Sees, did you see one? He does take out one, but what about the guy behind him? Oh no! Does get taken out. Shane as he goes ends up holding, ends up holding Charlie. Go to tabletop. We see wreck. Holding Bravo. Exert is already back pushing on Alpha. Already taking it back. All of these double caps by mortality are quite short lived. Scores right now 34 and 31 for mortality, 34 and 24 for Exertus. Mortality had. A quite a strong opening here, but all of it is, is been taken away. They're down by 20 tickets. Bravo is being contested, but Nemec being very careful. Very careful. Sees one long distances. His gun, though, can't reach out that far. Doesn't quite connect. Shane's still up, though. Bravo taken back by Exertus. Will there are there any backreaders going on? Not really. We see five of the tr of the mortality players kind of putting a line down on Bravo, but I like the fact that Nemec is in the back of Alpha, just waiting for a backreach. He's waiting for someone to spawn in in the back and take him out. It's just a grind fest right now. Troy had taken a lot of damage. Sees one way far out, but watch out for that nade. 70% health. He does get pushed, but wow! Does take out by. He's at 45% health, getting it back up. 28 bullets left, though. Will he be able to get anything out? Woohoo! 20% health. They are holding this strong. Or at least, no, I'm, I'm mistaken. Mortality did end up getting this back, but Troya held his position the entire time. They are getting back Bravo. Charlie is also being contested because Hitha is also on that and gets a great kill by Psycho as Psycho jumps through the second floor of the building. Ends up capturing... It's a triple cap in favor of Exertus. Where is Mortality? They have two guys on Alpha. Let's go back to the... Uh, oh, and they're taking Bravo as well. That that triple cap, not going to matter. Mortality ends up taking two. They got the cap instead. Thirty ticket lead for Exertus. A trade between Troy and Johnny. It looks like the tides have turned, and now. Mortality is holding the exact same combination that they were doing, that Exertus was doing against them. We see again Psycho holding the, the hole that Nemec was holding just a few minutes ago. Stila waiting for people to push on up. Here it comes any moment. She's one. Takes out one. That's a lot of, uh, a lot of water there.
Steel at 20% health, still at, no, has no nades, waiting for people to push on up at the same time, trying to wait for his health to come back into it. Flex goes down. This is what Immortality needed. It's nearly even tickets, guys. The third ticket lead by Exertus has been diminished significantly. And wait, Charlie's being taken as well. We see Shane as a ghost fighting, ends up trading. What's going to happen? We do see two Exertus players uh, on Alpha. Steel is going to try to get around him. He's waiting. He's got to be careful. He's got to listen. No. Psycho does take out one, two. But tries to go for revive. Steel does not get up. Wreck, though, does he realize that there are other players next to him? Sees one. Doesn't connect with one. Sees. Wow, nothing. He knows there's one there, but he gets flanked and hit in the side. Troya on Exertus is capping back Bravo. It's even tickets, guys. Troy had taken out. I kind of want to go to Wreck, though. Wreck, 15-11. Going for this flank yet again. We do see... Kila, Dota, and Bravo back, but no, oh, he doesn't get it. Johnny has said, looking for anything, anything they can do. Going to hit the holding Bravo down. 57 to 35. But he gets taken out by bye. Change the ghost. Also goes down. Going to Psycho. Taking Bravo. And a revive. Mortality's still in this, though, guys. Only down by 16 tickets. But they do have the burn in their favor. He knows there's one here. Oh! Nimic throwing that... Health pack gave him away. See Chains of Ghost, but Chains of Ghost takes out by by the time they get there. Uh, going to Psycho, he knows there's guys there. He's just waiting for him. But Shane somehow is able to take him out. Stila, though, gets retribution, but gets killed in the process. They know that Brawl is being taken. It's 31 to 37. This is getting close. Throwing nades. Five pushing around. Oh, does he see him? Wow, clicks is so low. Giant takes out Troya, but it's a triple cap in favor of Exertus. Mortality's got to do something. The, the bleed is not in their favor. Where are they? Oh, no. What are Mortality doing? The bleed is not in their favor. They're all wiped. They got to get something. Thirty-four to twelve. They, uh, what is going on? Guys, I think this is going to be the end. Fighting over Bravo so hard, they end up being taken out. One ticket remaining. Final score: thirty-three to zero. Exertus over Mortality. Round one. We will be switching sides for round two in just a bit. Looking at Troy's perspective, Exertus on U.S., Mortality on Chinese side. Now, Mortality has to win by more than the 30 or so tickets that Exertus won by.
Looking on the, the tabletop, a four-man push by Mortality on a Bravo. All White Psycho takes a side position. Not taking any damage just yet. You has flashbangs instead of regular grenades. Psycho does take out Troya. The bleed, though, is in favor of Exertus. Two Exertus players down, but two Mortality players down as well. Skilla is taking back Bravo. But how is Exertus going to respond? I don't see any. I see just two. I see Troy and Hith away on the side. Lots of ace spamming by Troya. Will we see Levolution in this map? No, not in this map. No Levolution in Domination. This is a strong hold, but what are, is going on? Exertus maybe have an opportunity. May have an opportunity. Oh, yeah, they're holding it. It seems that Psycho and his teammate are just sort of holding this down. They're not, I know that the bleed's against them. Just waiting to get some picks. Stila, there. I like Steelers' position. He's just waiting for a, a, a side rage on here. But again, they are... Exertus is still holding this down. 20 ticket lead for Exertus. Clicks those to go down by Stila. But... Charlie is being contested by Bai. He did end up getting around. They will end up taking a double on here. Nice. By does take out Nimic, who was positioned way up above. Will he end up taking the other one here that he sees? No. <laughs> By go gets taken out. Let's keep on going. Let's go to Troy. He is. Holding up on Bravo, they are holding Bravo down somehow. 177 to 140. Uh-oh. Guys, I think that I have a technical issue. I crashed. So, I'm sorry, guys. We're going to keep on going. I'm going to get back in the server real fast. Actually, we'll go to the uh, the intermission. Be right back. Luckily, I have an SSD that loads pretty fast. 183 to 104 in favor of Exertus. We do see Exertus uh, taking back Alpha. Troy goes down. Shane's a ghost holding on to Bravo. Barely. Charlie is, though, being taken back by Hitha. But Hitha is being pushed. Will he see this one last player on Psycho? Uh, ooh, Psycho gets taken out by Hitha, holding it down. Hitha playing the playing the long side ends up being seen 30% health. Hitha 11 and 4, really doing well for himself. 
does see a little bit of push. Oh, I got some tiger stripes on him. Ends up trading with Vi. Mm -mm. Where's Troya? What's he doing? They lost their uh, their the advantage that they have here. They need to be able to get uh, a flag again. Bleeds against him, but they're up by 40 tickets. That's still plenty of time. No, go to mimic. Alpha being taken back by Zerdis, all the while Bravo is also being taken back? It is. Hoo hoo. Maybe a trouble cap close. They do get it for a slight bit, but it's already being contested both on Charlie and on Bravo. Nimic trying to get back up, up under Bravo, but it's already being contested, already being taken by Mortality. I did like Nimic's position there. He is able to, to take out the guys at, lo at the long area. Rex, though, nearby. Look at all those pushes. Stila takes, gets taken out. But what about Rex? Rex is down. Nimic is taking back on Bravo, waiting for the push. Sees one. He seems to hide to hold his burn. Nope. He ends up dying. But it looks like Shane Azus was there, too. They end up taking Bravo back. But ooh, Shane takes out one. There's going to be another push. Here comes some more pushes. He pre-fires it and ends up taking out Johnny as well. A hundred and nine to seventy. If Exertus can just bleed off in our thirty tickets or so, thirty-five tickets. Whoa, Shane goes down. Nimic's actually one of the only two up. I think Bravo will be taken by exert it, or by uh, mortality, they do take it. Here comes a two-man push. Doesn't see it, Nimic takes him out handily. Already looking, already taking out, but here it comes. 40 ticket lead for Exertus. Ninety-six to fifty-eight. Charlie being contested. We have Johnny all the way on Charlie. Watch out for that barbed wire. It doesn't actually hurt you, but watch out for it. Uh-oh, Johnny's last one in the squad. Oh, no. Not looking good. Although they have two flags, but Bravo is being contested as I speak. Samri says, since when were MOBAs the main esports game? Well, I don't know if you've been at a bunker for the last few years, but they're the ones that have had the biggest prize pools. Johnny's, though, still watching the long area. No one at Bravo until Quick shows up. Oh, I like that. Ends up getting a twofer. Sees another. Will he be able to connect? Oh, Johnny's over there. Ooh, Rex barely, barely able to survive. His health slowly going back up. Charlie being taken in favor of Exertus yet again. Only a few more tickets, guys. The bleed still in favor. Oh, but others. That's a lot of, of, of Exertus players on Bravo. Rec trying to get around. Ends up getting an uh, uh, assist. Johnny taking up the advantage on that. 
They do have the bleed. But, oh, Rek goes down, going to Nemec. Stays up. Being flanked by both sides, Nemec does take out by and revives Shane not again, but Shane's dead. Nope. Guys, I think that's going to be the end. I think that Xertis is going to be declared the champions of this Level BF 5-5 Test Cup. There is no way that Mortality can win this map. Too many tickets have been bled. It's all for pride now. So congratulations. Congratulations to Xertis for winning the first Level BF 5 v 5 Test Cup, the first of many. We'll be experimenting with a number of rules uh, as we go forward. This one, we had a number of restrictions. We're going to open it up a bit in future cups. 39 to 21. Exertus, though, taking Alpha. Maybe taking Charlie? We'll see. No. Mortality still could take a round. Watch out for them smokes. Watch out for them flashbangs. Look at Shane rocking at AK. Nice jump. Taking out Steel of Shane as the ghost jumps down. It's a bit of damage, but he's okay. Exertus takes their second cap. Sees one. Oh my gosh, they jumped around him. Gets out the pistol. Shane as a ghost takes out another. Only one remaining. Johnny is still up. Shane as a ghost switches guns. Four tickets remaining. Three ticket two. 22 to zero. That's the final score. 22 to zero. Exertus wins both maps. They are victorious. So guys, we are not going to go to a third map. Exertus takes a clean sweep. So, that is the end of our 5v5 Test Cup by Level BF. I want to go to my desk. Here we go. And thank all of you for joining. Uh, check out Level BF for more events of this nature. We'll be doing some 10v10 December 14th and 15th, doing some uh, some dice developer community stuff come the 15th as well. Some more fun casual events. We'll be ramping up our 32 versus 32, which anyone can sign and play in in the coming weeks as well. You can uh, check out Brett, who casted many of the matches, but is actually catching War Access League. And actually, you can check out his channel right now. It's twitch.tv forward slash BrettFX. He's casting some 10v10 War Access League action. Go there for more awesome competitive battlefield action. And also, you can check me out at youtube.com forward slash Dasgro, Twitter slash Dasgro, twitter.com slash Dasgro, twitch.tv slash Dasgro. That's who I am. So, thanks everyone. Thanks to our admins. No blind and check, please. Thanks, Dark Times, for organizing this as well. Brett for coordinating all of it with the teams. Uh, Mess Rival Cartel for casting with Brett and myself. Thank all of you uh, for joining me. It's been a lot of fun. Hope to see all of you later. Have a good one. Oh, but he gets taken out. We see... We see Mortality already taken, too, for real fast. Looking at these setups, though, going to Troya, they're trying to get Bravo, but, oh, there is so much fighting, and we see mortality spread out. Troya knows his two guys are down, going for revive. Nope, no revives. They are being bled out. Wreck with a three for already. Going to Wreck. He is low, 40% health. But the bleed is in the favor of Exertus. Going to the tabletop. 
I do like what Rex doing here. He's going for Charlie, but does he know there's like, two guys behind him? He does see one, maybe. He gets blowed up instead. He did get back rage, although John, you know, also in the back. Taking a lot of damage. Charlie is being taken back by Exertus, all the while we see by pushing up onto Bravo. Sea Chain is a Garrett that gets taken out. Psycho gets taken out as well. Johnny's the only one up. Their 30 ticket advantage has quickly been reduced. Rack does take out one, holding down Bravo. This is the mortality that we saw throughout the rest of this event, holding it down, getting kills. They haven't died once, guys. Except now. Now they're now what? Now a few of them died. A good run this far. Wreck going ham. Five and zero. Oh. Johnny doing some damage. Guys that are watching, this stream is 60 seconds behind, approximately. Somehow, though, Exertus was able to get uh, both Alpha and Charlie and while contesting Bravo at the same time. The advantage has been flipped around, surprisingly. Alpha, though, is being taken, going to Steam. Stila is there taking back Alpha using the barrier instead of going through the metal tetris does not want to be heard. Stila taking the damage, watch out. Exertus is now holding this. It's 183 to 153 in favor of mortality, but Hey guys, Dasker here. This is the Level BF 5v5 Finals Cup between Exertus and Mortality on this map, Dawnbreaker. Exertus won the first map. It's best of three maps. You're going to like this. Where is Widgety, though? Widgety should have ops here, but wait, guys, enough about Widgety, though. We will be doing instead some live matches. This is live. They're all moving. We have uh, Mortality on US. We have... Exertus on Chinese. I like this. Shane is a ghost push. He is pushing out Charlie. I like this bottom flank. He sees one. There's a lot of damage. 